Okay. I think God wanted me to re-say how I was trying to say what I was just saying to y'all. Since we're here, since we're having such a come on in the room type of day. Um, I don't know who in my comments letting the Lord use you, but thank you, sis. I haven't had a chance to get back to y'all, but she's right. Don't block them, right? Because I've told y'all that the days and the moments where I'm most wanting to like hit the dash on him, that's when it's like, we needed to talk about something. That's when God moved on his end. And so I've been peeping like, why well, I feel like when God moving on his end, the devil trying to make me run off. Like, I, I see that so clearly. Like, God is moving and the devil in my ear like, black him. Act, baby. Do something stupid. Show him you're not the one, sis. Like, I feel like the devil be doing me like that. And so I wanted to get into some of these songs some more, too, because it seems like we're all picking up on a lot of the same things. Like, I was reading the comments like, what? y'all last night even in in the midst of all the confirmation or in the midst of all the testing and the distractions and the and like what is going on god was confirming a lot of stuff the the i told y'all he played my song for me randomly our song for me on shuffle when i was crying like i need my husband and all of a sudden the song came on i'm laughing and crying like holy spirit you so funny another thing before we hop into this when i was first trying to make it there are three vertical engineer brain vertical rainbows right now that i can see reflecting off of my mirror but i see it in my tv three vertical rainbows actually it's more than that it's like a whole thing of rainbows so the promise is like y'all this is like one two that's a lot of rainbows like I, I might try to take a picture and show you if i can show you what it looks like on tv but promises okay now he played our song. I was crying and stuff. I'm not going to tell you what that song was. The second song that came on was Play No Games by Big Sean and Chris Brown. And I was laughing because even back then, even when we wasn't talking, my song, and it always made me think about him. Now, I got to a point to where like I would just kind of like change the song, um, but it was always just like us. And then the third song that came on was Drake, Best I Ever Had. And I was like, Holy Spirit, you so funny. And um, I think for me, what I'm realizing, I believe... I know the testimony is going to be beautiful and um I never want y'all to think that I don't love this man I feel like y'all know like if you know you know and then I be thinking like oh I don't want my kids to watch this one day like listen I've always loved y'all daddy we just always wasn't you know we get on each other's nerves and we learning and growing and all that like we ran away from God we ran away from each other you know about like I always loved him it was just like you know and so that um realizing that there's always been like this knowing and so what I had tweeted earlier was in 2016 and 2017 I used to cry the entire 30 minutes to work just boohoo hysterical egg why so I'm not gonna lie to y'all this morning I knew I was in my feelings I didn't really help myself I was listening to August Alcina which reminds me of him I was listening to Trey Songs, which reminds me of him and um I for some of us this mountain, I think that's why my dream, come on, Holy Spirit, I've seen it as multiple couples trying to fight this mountain. Whether he's a celebrity, he's very popular in y'all's hometown, whatever, we are all fighting this same mountain. And so when I hear Trey Songs and August Alcina, who are indeed celebrities, sing about different things, I'm like, <laughs> why the same demon on all y'all? I, I don't know what it is, you know? And so, um, on the Tremaine album, I'm about to list every song that I, even back then, like I would just play it and I would cry. The one in particular is Song Goes Off. I would be hysterical every time that song came on. Egg, why? I knew that if I ever, like when I say it's always been like a knowing, I knew if I ever married somebody else, I'll just keep it real with y'all. I would cheat on them with him, period. So good to see you here. We both know it's been too long, okay? Song Goes Off used to just make me cry. And um, even my counterfeit, the one I told y'all remind me the most of him, I don't know if I've ever told y'all this in the video, but I remember this one other time we was fighting and he straight up told me like, if you could be with him, you would be with him. Facts, period. It's always been a knowing. It's always been a fight. It's always been a, God, I don't want to love him when he come back around because I knew he was going to come back around. It's always been like a, like, no, I don't want to love him no more because why all this had to be so tragic? Y'all get what I'm saying? Back to one of the, the same demons. Another song on there is Playboy and Trey Songz is like, 
Um, don't know why I'm still, still kissing girls that I don't love, you know? Still effing, but I want to make love. I'm sorry, but I felt the need to say that. And it goes back to the, they're not getting the real deal, even if they are sleeping with somebody else. There's a difference. I can say that because I know what I was out here doing. It's different when you... It, I'm sorry. Is is this how babies are made? Is this the love that's supposed to create another human? I know the difference. I've repented, like I said. But I know the difference. We got to be real. I, I don't mind being real with y'all, okay? So those two songs. There's another song on there. Uh, Games We Play. Also... Uh, it's, I hate that because it's just toxic and tragic and just why? Because I'm so like, okay, you're going to be on that. I'm going to be on this. Like, and in the song, Trey Song is basically saying like, you both lose. Like nobody winning. We just playing games. It's like no wins. Okay. That's, a, I like that song, but it, it, it it's, it's not so much as that like, it's more so like, mm -hmm. Like, just kind of, like, insight as to what you're up against, what you need to pray against, okay? So, I, and then, what's the other song, the album that everybody loves? Um, I don't want nobody else but you. Ooh, ooh, I, you know, they don't want nobody else but you, but it might still be a little Playboy in there, okay? <laughs> Who? okay. Um, so, okay, so back to... So I hit them the games we play, and then of course the Big Sean and the Chris Brown. I ain't like them other. I ain't about to play no games. Play no games. You know what your problem is. Uh -uh. You don't ever see the big picture. Oi! I want you to take me serious. Oh, baby. Okay, always reminded me of this, and um. I knew when it came on last night, it wasn't just like him and me. It was God, like, I'm not playing with you. Like, I didn't tell you to come back over here so that I could play with you. And I've told y'all that before. It was like, God, if you brought me back over here and you was about like, this is a sick, sick joke. And the only reason I know it was God is because of all the beautiful blessings and restoration that has come just from the level of reconnection we are at now takes me back to what i just shared about my sister's testimony when she saw us interacting and stuff i told y'all and she was like i want that and i was like what because nobody else treats me the way that he does nobody else loves me that way and so when i came back i've told him this it was like my whole life resumed after like five years it was like god was like because i started becoming even more restored all around like and that that's what their love does like i he see me as me he speak to the queen in me he brings that out of me he make me get on my stuff he be like why you he keep me focused on god he's the only person that's like megan you need to be working on this why are you not working on this like he has helped restore me back to all my projects to the correct mindsets you get what i'm saying the same way i know that god is using me to do the same thing in his life because that's what love from above does okay and so God is not playing with you if he's told you to stand, okay? Not in an hour where we can afford to play games. God not playing with us, we don't need to play with each other, okay? No winners, we just losing if we playing games. And we need to understand that, like, if you want it to be a, I ain't about to play no games with you from him, you need to make sure that you're giving that off. We, not you. We need to make sure we're giving that off. Because I told y'all, I petty Betty over here and just block you just because I felt like it. Like, I've actually never blocked him, though. And I feel like that's also important. Everybody else has been blocked. I have never in the entire history of knowing this man blocked him. Something in me would not let me do it. Do it. Okay? So, <sighs> breakthrough here.